It's like a nice warm sweetness. Mm. What do you think? It's good. Hey, what's going on guys? I'm gonna be cooking some fish here, let me show you. Oh yeah. That looks good, doesn't it? That right there is a uh, Mahi Mahi. And uh, <clears throat> went out fishing the other day, caught some dolphin. Um, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I didn't go fishing the other day and catch dolphin, so um, yeah, this was store bought. But hey, I can wish, can I? Anyway, a little bit of mahi mahi. What I did was uh, I put some olive oil in there and I sprinkled some uh, Everglades fish and chicken. This stuff is pretty good. And uh, then I put some cilantro. Uh, actually, you know what? I got it right here in the fridge. Yeah, the fridge is a little weird today, but uh, yeah, these little stackable containers you can get from Publix. Chive, cilantro, and ginger. And uh, these things, I just picked these up. I've been wanting to get these little containers for a while. Um, so anyway, this is gonna be some good stuff. Mahi Mahi, sprinkle some of that on there with some Everglades fish and chicken. And uh, with some olive oil in there, gonna let it marinate for probably a few hours. And I had uh, some lemon, cut some lemon up. Put some lemon juice in there. I'm letting that all marinate, kind of sitting there in the fridge for a little bit. Then I'll take it out while it's still marinating and kind of let it warm up just a little bit before I put it on the grill. And I tell you what, it's going to be so good. And also, <clears throat> I got the uh, pineapple and I'm going to put that on the grill as well. So this is going to be really good. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see how this happens. I got the recipe from uh, deer meat for dinner. Figured I'd give it a try. Cool channel, go check them out. Um, yeah, so next time you see me, all this is going on a grill. See ya. All right guys, back at the grill. So we have our Mahi Mahi fish. So we're gonna take this. Throw it on the grill. Just like that. We have our pineapple. So that's going to go on the grill as well. Just like that. And then we're going to let that cook. Okay, so we got our fish cooking. We're going to let it cook about halfway through. And then we're going to flip it. And our pineapple won't take very long to cook either. They just kind of gives it a little extra flavor when you put it on the grill and it makes it a little bit sweeter so oh man that is looking good looking real good oh yeah that's some good stuff right there I'm gonna go ahead and flip them. I did go ahead and move the fish over a little bit onto the flame so that's what we gotta do take this Boop. Oh yeah, there we go. I can turn it down just a little bit. Oh man, it smells so good. Ooh, flip that. I'm gonna take our pineapple. I'm gonna flip our pineapple. Just like that. That is really hot. Fish smells, fish smells really good. I can't wait to eat it. I wish all y'all were here with me to enjoy it as well. So it's gonna be good and we'll see you here in a few minutes. All right guys, that's the finished product. Not a giant piece of fish, but oh yeah. We'll go ahead and steal one of these pieces right here. Oh. Mmm. That's good. Oh yeah. That's some good fish. That's good. And apparently when you grill pineapple, um, it takes that kind of sour sting out of it. 
It's like a nice warm sweetness. Mm. What do you think? It's good. It's really good. Y'all go out there and try that. Pineapple on the grill it is really good. Really, really good. So, appreciate you watching this part. It wasn't too much in depth, but it was uh, it's pretty good. So, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, jump off here and finish this, and uh, we'll see you next time.